Hi guys, this is Vivek again coming to you from my Parisian life. I'm excited to show you one of my favorite neighborhoods in Paris. Well, a little bit of my favorite neighborhoods in Paris. And this is uh, Rue Montaigoy, Etienne Marcel, a little bit around the Sautier. Uh, I lived here for six years. I no longer live here, but I'm always here. Um, my son goes to school here. Um, and we will be starting off with my <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> I wanted to introduce you guys to Rue Bachemont because it's also one of my favorite streets like off uh, Rue Montaigne and you can find Nose which is a perfume and beauty shop as well. So another one of my favorite locations on Rue Bachemont is Au Cru de Bourgogne. This is a wonderful restaurant for traditional French food. I remember having uh, one of my first escargot romantic meals here uh, with my husband at the time. And uh, on the menu, there is other traditional um, uh, French food. So I also wanted to share that they have a 20 euros fixed price menu at lunchtime. So this is a great opportunity to eat uh, eat uh, cheap and chic in Paris at lunchtime. 20 euros cannot be beat. So here we are. We are on Rue Montaigne, one of my favorite streets in Paris. This is actually my old neighborhood, my old stomping ground, so I know so many stories about every single one of these establishments. Um, I really wanted to share with you guys Oroche de Cancale. Oroche de Cancale is a wonderful place to have also traditional French food. I love their camembert roti. That's a great way to start with your entree. And they have salad. We are standing in front of actually the oldest bakery in Paris and this is Dora on Rue Montaigne. This is actually a place that also Queen Elizabeth would uh, come when she visited Paris. So I wanted to also show you this cute little passage, the passage de concert, which is just off uh, Rue uh, Marie Stuart, which is I mean, perpendicular to Rue Montaigne. Um, I want to introduce you to Anais, which is one of my favorite flower shops in Paris. I'm very useful. So we are standing in front of my son's favorite shop in the neighborhood. So my son is a pastry geek. He is a self-defined pastry chef, so he loves to shop at G2. This is where we get our vanilla salt from Madagascar. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, my son buys vanilla salt. <laughs> We are 
are standing at Etienne Marcel, just in front of La Movida, which is also another great place to stock up on professional baking or pastry chef equipment. Another one of my son's favorite places. Um, we are also super close to Place de Victoire and the famous church, L'Église Saint Eustache. So we're at the end of my guide on the second half of this call. Everything around uh, Pontagon, Etienne Marcel, a little bit of the Sentier. I also want to say that we're super close to Leal and Leal is a part of Paris that has this rich history of being a working class neighborhood but also where people come and, and do a lot of their commerce and shopping. Um, you can find one of the most beautiful paintings actually right now at uh, Petit Palais that uh, I'm going to put the information on the painter in this video. Um, that shows what Leal used to look like a really long time ago. Um, today in Leal, you can find one of Paris's uh, most popular shopping malls and shopping areas, but also really good traditional French uh, restaurants are surrounding Leal. So Leal is also a really good place to know if you're coming to Rouen to go, if you're on Etienne Marcel. And I hope this video has been fun and informational. And please subscribe to my YouTube, it's My Parisian Life. You can also follow me on Instagram, it's My Parisian Life. And the blog is MyParisianLife.com. See you guys soon. Bye. 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 Bye.